both legends have left an incredible mark on Indian cricket, not just as an exceptional players but also as an influential captains. Their leadership style and achievements have sparked numerous debates among fans and cricket contents alike. After India won the T20 World Cup recently, two of India's cricket's most iconic figures, Virat Kohli and Rohit Sharma, announced their retirement from T20I cricket. Having played and captained for their country for nearly 20 years, the two modern greats of Indian cricket have earned many accolades. Virat Kohli led the squad first after when MS Dhoni decided to step down as a captain in the limited overs format in 2007. But Kohli eventually resigned in 2021 to make room for Rohit to take the captain's Hello and welcome back to another video. I am your host Abhinav. Despite having only been captain for a brief while, Kohli made a significant impression in that role. However, he was forced to leave for regrettable circumstances and Rohit Sharma has been the backbone of Indian cricket team since then. So let's talk about each of these players' dominance as a captain in different formats of the game. Kohli's dominance in Test cricket Throughout Indian cricket history, Kohli's captaincy stands out as one of the most successful in the game's longest format. In 68 test matches, Kohli guided India to victory with an outstanding winning percentage of more than 70%. The Indian squad finished with 40 wins, 17 losses and 11 draws while he was a captain. Indian cricket was transformed by Kohli's aggressive style and emphasis on fitness which made the squad extremely strong, particularly in the foreign circumstances. In contrast, Rohit Sharma has captained India in only 16 test matches so far. Although his sample size is smaller, his record is commendable. With 10 wins, 4 losses and 2 draws as of now, Rohit's calm denouer and tactical understanding have also been evident, particularly in home conditions. Not to forget, he has led India to two WDC World Test Championship Finals. Now in the ODA format, Rohit edges ahead. The ODA international format brings the two captains closer together. With above 77 win percentage, Rohit Sharma has guided India to victory in 34 of the 45 ODI internationals. His ability to maintain composure under stress and tactical use of resource has defined his approach to limited overs cricket. Kohli, on the other hand, captained India in 95 ODI, securing 65 wins with a win percentage of 70%. While Kohli's aggressive style helped India dominate during this tenure, Rohit's superior win percentage suggests a slight edge in this format. Notably, both captains share an identical record of both just 10 losses in ODIs, underscoring their consistency. Rohit Sharma's superiority in T20 format Rohit is a brilliant skipper in the T20 internationals. With a 78.69 win percentage, Rohit has led India in 61 games and achieved 48 victories. His performance in the 2024 T20 World Cup has solidified his reputation as India's one of the finest leaders even further made him the third Indian to lift a major ICC trophy for India. Although good Virat Kohli's T20 captaincy lacks a bit. In 50 games, Kohli guided India to 30 victories and a win percentage of 60%. Rohit is more successful T20 skipper despite Kohli's important role play and inspirational leadership in the shortest format due to his better numbers. Who was the better captain, Rohit or Virat? However, it's challenging to draw comparisons between these two Indian captains because of their difference in their roles at various times and the circumstances that they faced. In the ODI and T20 format, Rohit has a stronger record as captain, but in test format, Virat Kohli has superior numbers. Furthermore, because of Virat Kohli he is no longer leader in any format, Rohit still has time further to establish his legacy. As a captain, he has already won one ICC trophy. Nevertheless, while serving as captains, they both kept the team entertained and guided the side to victories multiple times. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button and share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel for more cricketing content. Until next time, this is Abhinandan signing off.